Natalie, how are you doing? The Will Snares back with another video. Second channel, subscribe. If you aren't already, check this out. The new, honestly, the new Gymshark gear. New seasonal Gymshark gear is freaking sick. So sick. <laughs> right, today we're back with another gymnastics reaction video. Remember, the subreddit page is now set up. We wanted to start a Reddit page for this channel so that we could once a week jump on there, build a community, and just laugh with each other. So make sure you're roasting me on there and, and putting all these gymnastics memes and fails and whatever you want because it's just going to be an awesome awesome community i've got today a compilation of gymnasts the oldest in age gymnasts in the world doing gymnastics i said gymnastics way too many times then gymnast, 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 gymnast. i've not seen this yet hopefully gonna be very very inspiring to see people i don't actually know how old they're gonna be but they're probably gonna be older than 25 i've retired at 25 and these guys are still smashing it out at whatever age but we're gonna dive in. Once again, if you haven't already, please back click on that subscribe button. It'd mean the world to me. It's completely free. You can change your mind at any time. Three, two, one, and... No! Uchimura's mum! 55 years old. Does she look 55 years old to you? And I'd like to say, no wonder, that King Kohai, King Kohi, is the king. 55, Mosh? I don't think my mum's 55. Okay, okay, special, just special. Spyro, eh? <laughs> if at 55, I could still step in a gym and do some flips, wow, that would be insane. That's so, it's so cool and to see that, she's still going up, to see that Kohi is, you know, it's obviously in the family. My mum actually did gymnastics, handspring to stick! Look at that, man. Sal, if you're watching this, we've got some training to do, love. <laughs> We're going to beat Kohi's mum. 60. 6 oh. 6 oh. <laughs> On the ringens. What we're going to do here, some swings. You can tell shoulder flexibility's gone a little bit. <laughs> Look at his body. I don't even know what it's called, like back fell or something. Just admirable. Just admirable. But that's an eight years old. Eight. Zero. <laughs> <clears throat> oh my gosh, look at him. He looks like a... He looks like one of them howling monks. I used to watch that as a kid, you know, like little boys that sort of like smashed the bricks off their head and just sort of, sort of like pain wasn't a thing. 80 year old swinging around a bar upside down. Two fingers. I hold the man. He's swearing at us now. I tell you what, you can swear at me when you can do that, lad. I'd be like that. However old, what I can do. Oh my gosh! That'll be that. <laughs> That's gonna be Emily at fucking eighty. <laughs> oh, it's it so is. This is me, we will be still me together and should just be getting up on a morning on the park bench just freaking doing the back exercises. Incredible. I don't know whether... How good is that? Oh my god. I've done the madness, is the lad. 80 years old, Bruno. Is he wearing hand guards or is he wearing straps? We've just watched Bruno 80 do a giant on bar. I think, well, he obviously was wearing handguards because he's let go. 80. I think, I, I want to make it a thing. I think Paul Hall does this, um, who's our head national coach and he's Lewis Smith's personal coach. His birthday every year, I think he gets onto the high bar and tries does 10 giants. Um, I believe that's right. I'm thinking maybe it's, this is something that I can strive for. Be cool, wouldn't it? It's say 80, like, you get on bar and do 10 giants. That'd be sick. Crowd is doing in front of him as well. 
Joanna Cass, 95 years old. 95. My grandma Dorothy is 86, I believe. Sorry, Gran. <laughs> and she can't bloody walk with all hip replacements and knees and done that she's had done. This 95. That is so bloody cool, man. That beam's slightly bigger than the... Slightly lower and slightly wider than we will let her off. She's 95. Do a cartwheel. Do a cartwheel. Ball draw, beautiful. Look at the strength. At 95, she'll live till 150. -er. Where's all this gymnast? again at the age of 57 when she met an old friend and they started training together. Right, listen to that story, listen to that. I get messages every time saying, is it too late to start gymnastics? I'm not too old at freaking 14. Our lass over here, I don't think I can call her our lass. Johanna picks up gymnastics again at 57. 57, my dad's doing it now at 53, best shape of his life. When are we gonna start thinking that gymnastics is something that we actually can take part in? Let's start now. It doesn't matter about, it's like one of these things, isn't it? When you start a sport now, when you're at my, at like at four years old, you're doing gymnastics to become an Olympian. Nah, we're doing gymnastics because it's fucking awesome. It gives us something to learn, it gives us passion, it gives us a body of our dreams, it gives us some core strength, it gives us the mental capacity to be able to overcome fear. You know it's like doing a backflip for the first time, those that have done it know, and it's like just, Remove this, right, yeah, they're these young athletes that just go on and like freaking do all this stuff at the Olympics, which that'll still happen. But everyone can take part in it just like you can play five a side football or just like you can go and have a round of golf with your mates, just like you can go to Zumba or you can go play netball or whatever your hobby is. Gymnastics is the same. And I want you all to do it and now we'll listen to gymnastics. <laughs> I'm sorry you're getting passionate about it, but this is just a month that she picked up gymnastics to get at 57 when she met an old friend and they started training together. Look, I'm the old friend, I'm not necessarily your friend, but I'm encouraging you to start gymnastics tomorrow. No, today. Get on the floor now and do a board roll. <laughs> I'm joking. But look, it can be done, it can be done. She's won 11 times at the Senior German Championships. Have you ever felt too old for gymnastics? I, I, I spoke too soon. We need to take a bit from the Asian culture. I think like a lot of them are doing this. Then we should just, we should do this without a doubt. Listen, just so special. I, I do know I think British Gymnastics has done a love to move chair gymnastics for sort of pension homes and people with dementia and stuff, just sort of getting their body moving in the wheelchairs. And it's just, it's just fantastic to see. I absolutely love it. And I encourage everyone. That That's kind of my biggest dream with doing all this stuff. And I've done hours and hours and hours and hours of content online you know, regarding the sport. And it's just mainly to just show that you can get involved and you doing it. It's just, it's just so special. It's just such a special sport. So comment below if it made you want to get involved because that would make me very, very happy. Remember, we have the subreddit page set up and remember to join the Wilson Air Club. It's the link in the description. If you haven't already heard me talk about it, we're literally changing the game with this community that we're building to just genuinely become better versions of ourselves. That's all I'm going to say. Please put your email in the link in the description and we'll jump on a call and chat about you getting signed up and on the Wilson Net Club team. Lots of love, train smart, keep it real. I, I don't say that for this channel. What do I do? I just stop. See you, bye.